The Good Financial Governance Program, in short GFG Tanzania, is a technical assistance program implemented by GIZ and funded by the European Union, the governments of Germany and Switzerland. The program aims to strengthen the public finance management system of Tanzania in the areas of domestic revenue mobilization and accountability, which are the two sides of the same coin. Following the uh, holistic approach of good financial governance, GFG focuses on four areas of intervention into the public finance management system. The first area being external audit, the second internal audit, the, the third domestic revenue mobilization and the, the fourth social accountability. This is my first priority and when I saw GIZ they came up with this program. To me, it is the most important program that I can ever run in the Longido district. This is the area that was causing all the problems in the governance of the council. All activities of GFG are closely planned, coordinated and implemented with the partners based on a capacity enhancement strategy, which most of all focuses on the partners' needs, verified through needs assessments jointly together in workshops. As a, as a council, we don't have enough funds to buy enough POS to collect the, the revenues in all points. But also we need to improve the infrastructures of the points where we are collecting the revenues. There are so many challenges. We have 18 posts. In order to improve the collection, revenue collection, we need more POS. Another thing which we need in order to improve the revenue accountant, we are few in number. Because right now you can see I'm alone. Also the part of training. We need to train the personnel who are involved in the revenue collection so that they have the skills how to use these POS machines in a modern way. The people who are using that machine, so many are local people who are not educated enough. Sometimes can, can make the post not working properly. Also, some, when the power is not enough, they failed to charge. Longido district is about 882 square kilometers. At the moment we have only one car and most of the areas are remote. Even if you place a POS machine in a certain point, you can be able to check. We don't have a transport, I mean a car, to reach the point where the, the money is collected. Today we are in the Longido district. Longido is one of the 15 local government authorities which are beneficiary in our domestic revenue mobilization component. We are supporting uh, the local government authorities in the collection of own revenue and efficient and effective management of the same. According to the Tanzania Development Vision 2025, domestic revenue mobilization is a key. To realize this vision, the government of Tanzania ordered that all local councils must collect revenue electronically. But there are challenges such as financing electronic equipment and training the users. Today we are here at Longijo District Council to train the users on the use of POS, point of sale machines. GFG has organized the training and purchased the POS. We have it here. Uh, these are QS Bluetooth printer and a smartphone will be used to collect the revenue so as to attain those goals. During the last three days, Mr. Mlacha has supported us significantly in familiarizing and distributing and configurating these point of sales machines for electronic collection of revenues. The point of sales are ready, the experts are ready, and um, we hope for a good on-the-job training session. What we're learning in the training is how to produce the invoice, how to attend the customer, how to produce the receipt, and how to use the system of correction. The training helped us to, to know the system very well. When I came here one year and eight months ago, we were collecting 400,000 per year. At the moment, we are collecting, uh, we collected 1.3 billion. We are an independent organ and we have done a tremendous improvement. The revenue correction cutters 
to all development activities and the essential services in the community of Longido. So the 35% will go to build schools, will go to build hospitals. We, we also provide water services. This community, we have 95% pastoralists. So we also need to support the livestock in Longido. For example, building up the laboratories to treat their, their livestock so we can construct different markets for the livestock. So collecting our own source revenue is very, very crucial. That's why we are putting in the efforts to make sure we are collecting enough revenue. Generating more domestic revenue at the local level will enable the local government authorities to also promote their ownership and accountability towards their community. I believe with the support of uh, uh, GIZ, uh, Longido District is going to double the amount of uh, revenue correction in Elongido. This program is going to make a difference in Elongido.